Hey everybody, Chris here. In this video, we're going to be talking about X Twitter becoming a payments app, when Elon Musk plans for that to happen, and whether Dogecoin is going to be part of that integration of payments on X Twitter. Please be sure to subscribe to my channel, hit that little notification bell. You can be notified when my new videos come out, as well as when I do live streams. I am live Monday, Wednesday, Friday. We talk about cryptocurrencies, particularly Dogecoin, but I also cover everything else, financial, whatever you guys have on your mind as well. I'm happy to talk about. So we start here. Yes, this is picture of Elon Musk and Peter Thiel back in the year 2000. That's right. This is back 23 years ago. Elon Musk was the co-owner of PayPal, the person-to-person -person payment system. And that actually came after Elon had started X.com. What was X.com? Well, X.com was a one of the first online banking sites launched in December of 1999. That's right. This was, and that was actually Elon's second company. He had also started Zip2, which was a sort of an online uh, shopping site that did all kinds of different things. This was the beginning of this dot com boom in the late 90s, and Elon was right in there at 28 years old. That's right. Zip2 Corp. Elon Musk then envisioned X.com. He got the domain name and then he was going to do it as a full scale banking and investment services site that offered everything from checking accounts to insurance services, mortgage lendings and bonds. Well, he didn't get off to a great start, but 100,000 customers, that wasn't bad. But he saw what PayPal was doing. PayPal had also started about that same time. PayPal was bringing in about 15,000 new clients a day with its payment to payment payment services. Not all that unlike what PayPal does today. It was doing back then. So there was a merger that happened between X.com and PayPal. And then, well, eventually there was kind of a falling out and I, uh, what the best way to put it was, well, Elon left. <laughs> Uh, PayPal ended up selling to eBay because PayPal was kind of like the number one payment on eBay for people. Um, and Elon made a crap ton of money, like $180 million out of that, which then he put into SpaceX and Tesla primarily, uh, beginning those companies, which then got him to be the wealthiest person in the world. But it all goes back again to PayPal. Eventually, in 2017, Elon Musk bought the X.com domain name back from PayPal because PayPal still owned it, but they weren't doing anything with it. So, so Elon bought it. And, well, it's kind of funny that the statement that PayPal made was, we are delighted to sell the domain X.com back to its previous owner, Elon Musk. That's pretty interesting. Delighted. And now it looks like Elon may be on the path of actually taking over person to person payments through X.com, which might really hurt PayPal's business. But we'll see how that plays out. Well, so what about Dogecoin? Well, that was 2017. By 20. 19, we had Elon Musk saying, Dogecoin might be my fave cryptocurrency. It's pretty cool. And that's where Elon's love for Dogecoin started. Then we had, uh, we had Elon here in 2020 who, uh, who tweeted, it's inevitable with the Dogecoin standard taking over the global financial system. This was this was just beginning. And was Elon just having fun with this? Did he really see what cryptocurrency could do to uh, standard banking? Hmm. But that was still back in 2020. Then we have, 
we have this 2021 dogecoin is the people's crypto so he was beginning to understand that dogecoin could actually be used as a currency and performed better in that than bitcoin or other cryptocurrencies as well so x or elon musk suggests making dogecoin a payment option for twitter blue service so this was in uh this was in april of 2022 and this is before Elon had bought Twitter, but had begun those discussions, which kind of started as a joke, maybe, but then the more and more he was talking with different people about it, this was very interesting. Everyone who signs up for Twitter Blue, like for $3 a month, should get an authentication check mark. So that was the beginning of his first ideas about Twitter when he bought it and maybe how he could get rid of bots and things like that. And talked about, yes, should be proportionate to affordability in local currencies, and then maybe even an option to pay in Doge. So again, a reference to Doge and a reference to how he may be able to deal with payments um, across country borders and not have to worry about all of the local currencies around the world. So that's kind of where that started. Elon Musk's Twitter overhaul could be huge for Doge and crypto. Elon clearly has an affinity for Doge, almost as part of a running joke. But I wouldn't be surprised if he actually went through with enabling payments via Doge. This was in July of 2023, and all of this talk about Elon and the rebranding of Twitter into X, which it is now. I could just call it X Twitter so people understand what, what I'm talking about. But Elon's desire to make this app an everything app, which is much like WeChat, China's WeChat, where you can do all kinds of things like buying things, talking to people, uh, either through phone, video calls. Uh, as well as a uh, social media site of, of posting things. All of that can happen on WeChat, as well as payments and making payments. All of that could, could happen on X. So that is Elon's, or Elon's idea, is to do that. So will, will Doge be added by Elon Musk? Well, here's what Raul Paul says. Uh, Two things I've said when Elon bought X. Elon bought it for the AI and the free speech angle to give it an unbiased model. He needs the AI to train the Optimus robot, which I think is a little bit of a stretch. However, that the bias that is happening sort of on other sites uh, on the internet, Elon didn't really want to be part of, but kind of interesting how, how that's an idea. But Raul also said he will use crypto to be able to make global payments for creators, etc. My guess is he uses Doge. So that's that's what's out there. And again, no talk about Bitcoin or XRP or anything else. It's it's just Doge. So X announces upcoming payments integration. Is Dogecoin on the list? Well, certainly Dogecoin enthusiasts buzzing with anticipation following re recent developments on X Twitter as part of an ambitious expansion to enhance its everything app. X is introducing a range of payment integrations. And with Elon Musk at the helm, many speculate that Dogecoin could be among the supported cryptocurrencies. Well, among the supported or the that that's kind of what we're we're down to right now is 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 whether that is the case we have a uh, payments feature coming soon to x platform and this was last month when x ceo linda yaccarino um, put out a video just showing all of the different things that they're working on, how X can begin to expand its services and become this everything app. And one of 
uh, the stills from that was this X payments uh, slide here. Uh, the idea was that you know you could look up a recipe, you could bake a cake, something like that, and then you could have someone pay you for that, and the payment could be made right on X. That's right, it could happen right on X. And so X payments is something that we know that the X Twitter engineers are working on. And when are we going to have this happen? Well, last week, Elon said that he unveils plans to make X a financial hub by 2024. That's right. When Musk took over the social media giant last year, he revealed his plans to make the platform and everything app, offering users opportunities to send money anywhere in the world instantly in real time. I think the only way that he could actually do that is with crypto. So all of that talk about Doge up to now may be coming into something that could actually happen. Elon Musk gives employees one year to replace your bank. Elon says, you won't need a bank account. It would blow my mind if we don't have that rolled out by the end of next year. So this was an all hands call on Thursday that Elon had with ex employees telling them that they'll be surprised with just how powerful this is all going to be. When I say payments, I actually mean someone's entire financial life, Musk said. If it involves money, it'll be on our platform, money, securities, whatever. So it's not just like sending $20 to my friend. I'm talking about like you won't need a bank account. That is what Elon is talking about. So this is very exciting. Uh, and I know many people just just will dismiss Elon. But look what he's already done with Tesla. Look what he's done with SpaceX. People that s tell Elon he can't do something, I think just makes him work harder to make things happen. So. The company is currently working on locking down money transmission licenses across the United States so that it can offer financial services. Musk told employees Thursday that he hopes to get the other's X needs in the next few months. Now, we know Elon does have a habit of exaggerating how quickly things can be done. So next few months could turn into a few more, most likely, but, but it's coming. Musk has discussed his plans to turn X into a financial hub before. This goes into the past again about X.com and PayPal. So this whole this whole thing in the in, in Elon's past, he's done this before. And to bring this to a new level now happening is very exciting. So so that's what we have from Elon's humble beginnings back with PayPal. 23 years ago and now turning into this X app and X payments is coming. It's coming. And for Dogecoin, well, the Dogecoin standard over the overtaking the global financial system, Elon said it's inevitable. And what have we seen? Elon has a way of making things happen. With Dogecoin, I think he's had enough hints about Dogecoin that Dogecoin is going to be part of it. Let me know in the comments below what you think about the X app, Dogecoin, this global financial system. Give the video a like. If you haven't already, please subscribe to my channel. I appreciate the support. We'll see you next time.